How do you feel when you see something like this while searching your favorite product? Here, the time left creates a sort of urgency or scarcity of time which makes the buyer or the website visitor buy the product. So this is kind of a urgency created when the customer is on the website. So let us check out if we can create such type of design on our website. Welcome guys, this is Prakash from theskillville.com and in today's session, we will look at two amazing plugins which are free but they can create amazing designing work on the product page. So this particular design and the other one is kind of a timer set which shows the time left for the product discount. So this particular format you can achieve with a free plugin called the product time countdown for WooCommerce. So I will leave the link in the description and you can check this plugin as well. But in today's session, we will look at this particular amazing plugin, the ultimate urgency and scarcity creating tool. The name of the plugin is Finale Light Sales Countdown Timer and Discount for WooCommerce. So I will just click install. The plugin is installed. I just need to activate it. So this has already been activated. So once you activate it, go to WooCommerce settings and here you will find a new tab that is finale light excel plugin tab so if you click on that you will see something here as the finale campaigns so uh, by default there will be one campaign already created and you can create multiple campaigns like this so i will activate it and to edit this campaign, here I can do the date settings. So I'm just keeping it as it is starting uh, yesterday and it will end on 1 a.m. tomorrow. So you can set the time here. If it is GMT or the time zone, you can change all these things. And below, you can select the individual product or the product categories to which you want to apply this countdown timer plus bar. So, here, if you look at that drop down, you'll get all the options where you can apply this particular timer. So I'm selecting this for a product and you can have these conditions like if the product is or is not. So I will select the product is and I will say leather and it populated the product name. So this product is already there in the product list. So you can add multiple products here if you want the same discount or this particular offer applied to multiple products so here you can add multiple products so there are different settings as well so you can set the discount so here what i'm doing is i'm keeping 50 percent discount on the purchase for these products till the time that we had scheduled. So if the person purchases this product 
by 28th of February 1 a.m. they will get 50% discount. So you can set different conditions here. Override this discount if sale is set locally or these are the parameters. So you can have a fixed amount as well. So here I will just go and update it. So let us check out the outcome of it. If I just refresh this page now, here it is. So it shows hurry up just eight items left in stock and it is giving me a deadline for six hours and 49 minutes. And since it is ticking, I will have to make my decision and buy this product as soon as possible. So this is a kind of setup that you can do on your e-commerce store and this will definitely increase the sales on the website. So that is all for today and we will continue exploring new plugins in the coming sessions. Thank you so much and take care.